सूर्यनगर अलवल my short term goal is to get a job in a reputed company and my long term goal is to become a dotnet developer in the same company and that's it about myself okay what are your hobbies yeah my hobbies are uh, listening to music playing chess etc okay what are your strengths my strength is uh, i'm a hard worker and uh, multitasking प्रोग्रामिंग लैंग्वेज इट कंसिस्ट ऑफ ऑब्जेक्ट एंड क्लासेस ऑब्जेक्ट इज नथिंग बट ब्लू प्रिंट ऑफ ए क्लास क्लास इज इंस्टेंस ऑफ एन ऑब्जेक्ट द की फीचर्स आर ऑफ उप्स आर देर आर फोर four key features they are abstraction encapsulation polymorphism and inheritance coming to abstraction hiding of unwanted data and uh, displaying the wanted data is nothing but uh, abstraction uh, for example if we take two mobiles and one mobile is having uh, the features like calling messaging etc and other another one is having uh, calling messaging and uh, youtube etc so the common features between the two Uh, two mobiles is calling and messaging so such uh, data will be displayed uh, this is a example for abstraction coming to uh, encapsulation encapsulation is nothing but wrapping or uh, grouping of of data de- members of data class into the member functions is nothing but encapsulation uh, it is nothing but it hides the details of the internal details of the object for example if you take a bag and we store uh, pencils books etc in, inside the bag so it hides the internal uh, data and display i mean internal data of the object which is known as uh, encapsulation and uh, coming to polymorphism poly means many and morphism means different behaviors so one form uh, it is having different behaviors uh if we take an example behavior of a te- uh, teacher with a student and uh, behavior of teacher with their seniors so here uh, the teacher is nothing but object and uh, uh, behaving his way of behaving with uh, seniors and uh, here uh, it is nothing but attitude it will be different so which is nothing but an example for polymorphism Okay. coming to inheritance acquiring the properties of uh, one into another is known as inheritance it is of four four types multiple inheritance single inheritance multi level and hybrid inheritance okay. what is uh, method overloading and method overriding in method overloading methods must have same name and different signature whereas in uh, method overriding it has same name and the same signature Okay. What are constructors? Constructor is a special method which is used for uh, instanting the objects. Advantage of using the constructor is it is called only when the object for a class is created. Types of constructors are default constructor, parameterized constructor, uh, copy constructor, private constructor, and static constructor. Coming to default constructor, it has no parameters, whereas uh, parameterized constructor it has one or more uh, parameters uh, in copy constructor the variable it, it we can you create an object and uh, copying uh, it copies variables of another object it is known as copy constructor uh, coming to private constructor using the pi- private uh, keyword we can uh, create the constructor uh, whereas in static key, static constructor there is no use of creating an object this is about constructors okay uh, what are data types data types are used for uh, storing different types of values and variables 
it is of two types a value type and reference type value type uh, for uh, whereas in value type we have different uh, data types like int float double char uh, decimal etc coming to reference type we have object string and etc okay Uh, what are arrays? Arrays are nothing but uh, collection of items of similar data type. Some advantages of using arrays: static memory allocation and uh, static memory uh, management, as well as index-based manip manipulation. Uh, and it is of three types: one is single-dimensional, mi multiple-dimensional, and another one is jagged array. Uh, in single-dimensional array, uh, we can store the values in a single row double dimensional arrays uh, we can store uh, the number uh, it contains number of rows and we can store the values in the number of rows coming to jagged array it is known as array of arrays where each element is known as array okay uh, what are operators operators are nothing but uh, we can perform the operations on uh, variables and values there are different kinds of, of operators like arithmetic operators uh, logical operators uh, bitwise operators uh, ternary operator etc loops loops in loops uh, a statement or a group of statements can be executed multiple times different types of loops are the while loop for loop do while loop and nested loop okay Okay, Bhumika, as of the, uh, now we are done with the second round of interview. Okay, so you will get the call from our HR team. Okay, okay thank you. Yeah.